This year, National Friends of the Library Week is October 17th through 23rd, and we are so fortunate in Fairfax County with our library system to have more than a dozen wonderful friends groups who support our individual library branches and our entire library system. This week may be a specific time where we get to honor the friends for all their contributions, but really it's an all year long kind of thank you because they are extraordinary volunteers who dedicate their time and dollars for the benefit of our library system. We have friends groups for almost all of our library branches and traditionally they take in donated materials, they resell them, and then they give the money back to our local branches to support things like additional books, children's programs, new furniture, really anything the branch needs. And some of our friends groups even support system events like purchasing ebooks for our collection, supporting our system wide summer reading program. Really, if you can think of a need our library system has, our friends of the library have done it for us. I started this group, and it was before the library was more than a gleam in anybody's eye. So we were going for like six years before the library was even built. It's nice to be a part of it, that's all. And if I weren't involved with the friends, I would probably spend a lot of time here anyway. But this way I can have more of a stake in it and feel more, more ownership of it. And I, I like that. It's, uh, it helps me to help them. And I think that if you get involved with your library and get involved with your friends group, you can, you can make a difference. You can really feel proud that you're, you're part of it. We're there to do whatever we can do. We're not allowed to hire staff, <laughs> but we can supply materials, we can provide program materials, equipment, uh, books for the collection, and I think we provide a real service to have the book sale. It's a place uh, where people can get together, and we found that in the pandemic where people couldn't physically get together, they could at least come to the library and use our uh, book delivery uh, out front, the pickups and things like that. And of course in the pandemic, our e-book systems have been very, very uh, important. Uh, our friends group provided some money to uh, increase e-books and I'm sure other friends groups did as well to the system because there's only so much money in the budget and you know the county does its best, but, but we really needed to beef that up and we were able to. I'm their biggest fan. I'm the biggest fan of the Friends of the Burke Center Library. They're wonderful, they're awesome, and they are so generous and so helpful. I just collected um, volunteer hours for the Friends, how much they contributed, and last month we had a large book sale, and they recorded 475 volunteer hours that, that individuals spent their precious time and energy running this book sale. They just help us do our job and do it better, and to be honest, we, just, we couldn't perform the way that we perform without them. To all of our friends groups out there from our libraries, big and small, I wanted to say thank you. We could not operate the way that we do without your support and your help and your dollars and your enthusiasm and your advocacy. The work that the friends do matters and the work that you all do creates the libraries that our community loves.